Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name's Thomas if you are brand new here and I make style and hair related videos every single week. So if that's your kind of thing, make sure you hit the subscribe button and come back for more long haired content every single week. So in today's video, we are going back to something that I did a while ago that was really fun. It was reacting to hair growth time lapses. So if you are brand new here, um, I have been on a hair growth journey for about two years now. <laughs> and this is kind of what is going on. We're getting longer and longer as we go along. But the main idea of this was to review some hair growth time lapses to help anybody that's going through the growing out stages stay motivated and really like pursue getting your long hair because it is like a wild rough journey and there is so many times where you feel like quitting. I just found content like this really helped me stay motivated and I know it helped a lot of other people so I thought why not do another rendition. Previously what I did was I went and found a heap of time lapses that I thought were cool and then I featured them but this time around I actually I'm doing it off the cuff. I've never seen these time lapses before. I kind of just put out a poll or like a question saying, hey guys, can you submit me a hair growth time lapse and I'll go and watch them on this video. So that's what we're doing. I haven't even seen these ones before. I know a couple of the people that have submitted. So without further ado, let's get into them, hey? So the first time lapse is from a guy called Matt and I'm pretty sure his Last name is Shampy. I don't know, I follow him on Instagram. I actually, with Matt, there was a picture of him smiling with his friends. The, his smile is very similar to mine. And when I saw him, I actually went, what the fuck, I'm not in that photo. And it was actually him and I was like, who is this guy? Anyway, he, when I put out my question asking people to send me their time lapses, he submitted one and we're gonna be watching that now. I have not seen this yet. So this is a, First reaction, and I've got my little lappy here just so I can watch. This is where I minimize and go down here. All right, let's see what Matt's got. This is only 38 seconds, so it's gonna be a nice quick one. Whoa, really dark hair. I think Matt's really handsome, by the way. Cool septum. Wow, ah, look at those curls. Whoa! Oi. This guy has sick curly hair. Actually, that, I think that's why I followed him on Instagram, because I was like, damn, you're giving me a run for my money. So this is April 2017. September 2019. Two years of growth. Cool! That was awesome. Um, Matt, I actually, yeah, I follow you on Instagram and I love your shit. Your, he, I think that's actually a pole dancer. He's a really interesting guy and he has super dope hair. So I might just put a little call to action for his Instagram here if you guys want to check him out. Because for hair inspo, I actually use his Instagram for hair inspo, which is odd because I think he found me through hair inspo. But hey, whatever. Thank you for submitting that time lapse. That was actually really cool. I'm jealous of your hair. I'll see you on Instagram. Alrighty, so we've got our second time lapse. We got this submitted to me through Instagram, and I asked this person, Nick Bosma, uh, to just email it through to me with a little bit about like his hair growth journey. I think he did write a really big description with this, but what I'm gathering, he wanted to give long hair a try. He doesn't feel ashamed anymore about having long hair. He loves how long hair can change the look of your face. He's a singer, loves hair, and his name's Nick Bosma, and he's from the Netherlands. Okay, so this one is from Nick Bosma. So I just said a little couple of details about him before, and here we go. So this starts in May 2019. So that's only a few months ago, and it looks like he, from this very first image that I'm seeing, it looks like he has an undercut uh, with a couple of little curls on top. I really love the color already, um, but let's watch this. Let's see how long it actually goes. So it's only nine seconds. Okay. Whoa. Look at that volume. Oh my god, Nick, this is so short. Like, give me a second to actually look at everything. Like I said before, I haven't actually watched these before. I didn't know that it was only nine seconds. Um, I wish there was more time in there just to see more of a dramatic change. I mean, I can see that you went from a zero to around about stage six or stage five. That's kind of where it looked like. I mean, thank you for making the submission. I like your hair color and good luck on this growth journey, okay? 
stick in there. And when you get to like one year or a year and a half, make sure you send me another one and add on to this because it, it was a bit short. <laughs> <laughs> I've listed this down as no idea because I think these came from just people recommending good time lapses on YouTube So I have no idea who I'm about to watch. I'm just about to click it and then have a look Okay, before we press play this one is from Joshua Hudson He's got 285 subscribers and this is a three-year hair growth time lapse and this was uploaded in May 2019 this one goes for a minute This is a good time and I think we can expect some really great stuff. So what we can see in the first frame here is 8th of the 3rd, 2016, three months post haircut. So he's had a haircut, three months later he started documenting this, and we're about to see three months of hair growth. So let's go with this. Again, already can see that he's blonde, and I'm jealous. Uh. He like... Gets his face in the direct center every time. How does he do this? Whoa. He's got hair like Matt. Fuck. That length though. Oh, there we go. We change angle. <laughs> Gotta zoom out. <laughs> 5th of, uh, 20th of the 5th, 2019. Whoa. That is cool, man. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, Mr. Joshua Hudson. Two questions for you. Do you get highlights in your hair? Because I noticed that you had dark roots, but like all the ends are nice and blonde. So do you do something there or does that just naturally how it goes? And in the three years that you had it, you look like you have a similar hair length to what I do right now. And what my question was, was how often were you getting trimmed in between these hair growth time lapses? That's an interesting question because I would have thought like where my hair is at right now is about the two year mark. And in another year, I believe it's gonna be like at least past my nipples. So I'm surprised that yours wasn't or it could have even been that it's curly. I don't know. If you can let me know in the comment section, that would be awesome. And thank you so much for this timeline. I'm pretty sure this one was a submission from you. I'm not sure if somebody said that it was a great one or not. Some, I have had a lot of recommendations for these. So I don't know who's submitted what. Thank you for being on here. Well, and that brings me to our final time lapse for today. I thought there was five, but there's only four. Long hair transformation. This one is a bit of a long one. It goes for two minutes. Fee Loki, man growing long hair. Six years in 110 seconds transformation. Ooh, this should be good. All right, pick one. Okay, his hair's very short here. A little bit longer, a little bit longer. I don't think this is a pick per day. Because, like, literally within the last six images, his hair's gone from, like, this to, like, this. I think this was a recommendation to watch and wasn't a submission. And now it's just pictures of him flipping his really long hair. It is pretty majestic though. And there's like this random slow-mo. Oh, I kind of like it actually. Whoa. Oh, his slow-mos are good. <laughs> we need to learn how to do this. Cosplay. We're about to do that next. Another slow mo. Fucking hell, that is so long. That's like down to his butthole. <sighs> this is actually majestic hair. It's not. A, it's not even a time lapse. Look at it. It's like little bits of time lapse and then it's like whoosh. I could just watch him all day. Fuck. 
to be continued. Well, that was interesting, actually. <laughs> I really, like, when it first took off, right, like, it started, I mean, you guys just saw, but he went from, like, really short hair, long, 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 and then it looked, like, down to his nipples long, and I kind of went, what's going on here? This is, like, too quick for a two-minute thing. And then after he incorporated all of those, like, swish, like, slow-mo hair flow things, that was actually bloody brilliant. But I just feel like the time-lapse part of it was just not as what I'm used to seeing. But anyway, he had very short hair in the beginning and literally like to the end of your penis long by the time at the end of that video. That was awesome, epic, that's goals. The creator, the creator of that video is um, Feed Loki. And he's into anime too. We do have another one, yay! Let's open it in YouTube. So this one is from Damn Nudie. This is a 12 month hair growth time lapse. So what we can see in the beginning here, he's got a disconnected undercut with a little bit of growth on it, possibly about two months. And then we can see in the second photo, he gets to sort of like a medium length. Oh. <gasps> this is a triangle face shape. The jaw is the widest part, then the cheekbones, then the eyebrow bone. This is it. Yeah, look at those. The, look at that chin. This guy's quite cute. We're in 2019. Whoa. Really thick hair too. What's with all these blondes? Seems like it's not changing length now. I like it. I have a note for you guys as well. <clears throat> Looks a bit a little bit funny when he straightens it to me. I really like it when it's natural, like with his natural wave. The texture of it looks really, really good, and it looks really healthy as well. Oh, we got a man bun! Cool! Yeah, love that. Just pausing here on this last frame, where he's looking directly into the camera. Okay, number one, loved the time lapse. I thought this was pretty cool. Two, I thought that your hair grows a little slow, to be honest. Like, it looks like you've only grown like about six or seven inches within a 12 month period. That's less than under an inch every month. So that's crazy. Did you get any trims in this? Number one, if you're watching this. And then two, guys, I just want you to take note. This guy has a triangle face shape. So if you watch my face shape video that I did, I dropped one not long ago talking about face shapes and long hair. And I did cover that a guy with a triangle face shape will have the widest point being his jaw, his next narrowest, next widest being the cheekbone, and then the next widest or most narrow will be their forehead. And this is what we've got with this guy here. So if we have a look, the peak of his eyebrow is narrower than his cheek, and then his jawline is the widest part of his face. Now, this medium hairstyle is actually a perfect length for this. See how the the hair that sits around the front of his face actually fills in where his forehead is so narrow. That's why this looks really good. And he also looked really good before he grew it out. Anyway, I don't need to go too far into that, but this is just a perfect example of a triangle face shape, like this last frame, and how long hair can really work with it. Yeah, that's all I wanted to say on that, and I really appreciate the submission. Thank you to Damn Nudie. 
Do you guys like my swivel chair as well? It's pretty cool, eh? And all right, guys, that brings us to the end of watching our hair growth time lapses. I'm pretty inspired, actually, especially by the third guy with how long he got his hair and all of those swish, like, slow-mo. Can we just play some more of that right now? I really have to get on to doing them. I'm inspired to grow my hair that long. Well, actually, I don't have a particular goal. It's like whenever it's too long, I'll chop it off. Well, not chop it all off, but chop it back to where I'm comfortable. But at least to my nipples. I need to get it a little bit longer and just test the waters. But yeah, for the most part, inspiring. And I'm really glad that so many of you are still on this journey and growing your hair out. And I'm really keen to hear about it in the comment section below. If you haven't seen my other hair growth time-lapse review videos, you can find one here up in the cards and another one here up in the cards. They're both up in the cards for you. And that's pretty much it. Let me know where you're at on your journey. And if you do have a time lapse, please submit it to tguard1993 at gmail.com because that's where I like to receive these submissions and review them. I hope you guys have a really lovely day and enjoy the rest of your week. Until next Monday, I'll see you then. And ciao for now. What else can we find on here? What porn is good to watch? I'm just, I actually don't know. I'm just trying to buy 20 seconds of time uh, at the end of my YouTube video. Oh yeah, I meant to make a call to action. Watch my other hair growth time lapse thing here. And my other one here. And subscribe just here. Was that 20 seconds?